Marcus Matthew, last month on October 31st, President Trump issued a proclamation designating November 2019 a National Native American Heritage Month. This November and every month, we celebrate the culture and heritage of these remarkable Americans who deeply enrich the equality and character of our nation. Now to Emily with the birthdays. Hey, it's Emily with the sports. Yesterday afternoon, the Cardinals lost 31-34 to to the Miami Dolphins. Hopefully their next game will be better. And now to Alex with the lunch. Hey, yes, I'm Alex with the lunch. And today we have a cheesy pizza sticks with marinara sauce, a chicken filet sandwich, and a fruit and cheese pack. That is it for today. And now to the next segment. Good morning, Sidewinders. This is Mr. H in our new studio. Please listen carefully to this announcement because I'm going to be asking all of our students to pick up something and do something a little differently this week. Here's why it's important. Uh, in this new studio, and really all throughout our campus, each time a, a, a new person comes to sit at this desk, we sanitize it with a wipe or a spray or something to make sure that um, you know, it's not doesn't have COVID, and that's one of the safety measures we take. Every time you sit down at a new surface, at a new desk, that surface should be sanitized. Our teachers take on a really big responsibility, an awesome responsibility, in keeping their classrooms safe and clean. And the school supports our teachers with lots of hand sanitizer, spray disinfectants, and things like that. Cleaning between each class is a lot of work, and I know there are students that are volunteering to help out their teachers with that. It's really important. Beginning this week, I'm asking students to have a backup, not just for their hand, for hand sanitizer, but also for surfaces. We need you to be a part of the solution in the event that maybe your teacher has to step out of their classroom, or maybe we have a substitute teacher. It's real important that our students, too, are active in wiping things down. Each time you sit at a desk or a table, it should be wiped down. If that doesn't happen for any reason, you should be prepared. For this reason, I'm asking all students to bring and carry in your backpack disinfecting wipes. They are called surface wipes or antibacterial wipes, sometimes sanitizing wipes. They come in two kinds. These are kind of the bulky uh, plastic containers. Uh, you're welcome to bring these. They do take up a lot of space in your backpack. Probably what's better are these, the packets you can get at all different kinds of stores. Some of these are from Walmart or Costco or places like that, but it's important. So these are what they look like. And by the middle or end of this week, uh, I'd like for you to have one of these in your backpack. That way, just in case you are prepared. I want to be clear that these should be for your own personal use. We're not asking you to buy these for your whole class or for others. Although you may choose to share them with a friend if they need one. If your desk or table is not clean for any reason, we want you to have a supply on your own person to take care of this. So here's what I'm asking you to do. Talk with your family and aim to getting one of these in your hands or backpack by the end of the week. Uh, your first period teachers will be checking in later this week to see that you have them. Thank you for being an important backup and being a part of our solution in our efforts to keep our school as perfectly safe as possible. Thank you for listening. Be kind and be brave, Sidewinders. Hi, this is Absin. Today's high will be 61 and the low will be 42. Now back to the anchor. Hey, DSM, it's, it's Mason. Students, it is so important for you to take care of your Chromebook. It is very costly if you break one. If you have your Chromebook open, make sure you do not have anything on your keyboard when you close it. This will for sure crack the screen. Even if you lay a pencil on your keyboard and close your Chromebook, it might crack the screen. To replace a Chromebook, it is $150. Be careful, guys. That's all for today. Make sure not to close your screen on an object that's laying on your keyboard.